Hello guys, my name is WOC01 TV. Wait. Wait, what? Are you ready? <laughs> So the person I am going to be reviewing on someone I met is... Ooh, Chavo! Chavo, todo Meeting, oh my god, I can't speak. But meeting Chavo Guerrero was really cool. He was a really nice guy. Um, I remember I talked to him. Um, he asked me if I watched TNA because that's when he first signed the contract. And um, I got this signed right here um, by Chavo Guerrero. And um, I'm also probably going to sell it. Um, it's a really good piece, but um, I just need some money. Um, I'm not sure if I'll sell it actually because I might be meeting Rey Mysterio, so um, I might get that signed. But I have a deal with the wrestling guy now. Me and Randy Hardy have a deal, um, which I'll tell you in another video. Um, so I get to get two autographs, so that's cool. I might get that and the classic superstar signed. Um, and the second thing I got signed was this, the eight by ten. It says two Willie. Chavo Guerrero, Viva La Raza. So yeah, he was really nice, and um, yeah, um, out of 10 stars, I'd probably give him a 9, or maybe even 10, he was really nice, um, so yeah, now time for me to answer your questions. Yeah. YouTube from the YWN asks, if you was a wrestler, would you be heel or face? And how long do you spend editing and recording your videos? I would 100% want to be a heel. Heels are amazing. I love heels. And um, how long does it take to edit one of my videos? WLC No One TV takes like an hour, an hour and a half. But a regular video, like an update video, will really take me like 30 minutes. Um, informational video, I don't even edit them. So um, yeah. Um, also the the news videos, those are like around 30 minutes as well. So. Yeah, next question. 3DX Wrestling asks, Will you be getting WWE 2K15 and how do you have so much money for figures, aka baller status? Well, that was weird. But, I get money by selling on my eBay, which is W.O. Cena 2. Cheap plug. So go check it out. WS Animation asks, my question is who is your favorite wrestler? My favorite wrestler, wrestler is by far um, Dolph Ziggler. So next question. Jack Fan asks, who's better, Dean Ambrose or Seth Rollins? By far, without a doubt, it's definitely Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins is one of my favorite wrestlers. So yeah, next question. King Axel asks, how are you so awesome? Would you rather go out with two... Divas or get your top five favorite wrestler signatures. What site do you usually get your figures off of and can you sub to me? How am I so awesome? Simple. You just need to have one of these. See? Awesome. That's all you gotta do. And um, would I rather go out with two WWE Divas or meet five of my favorite wrestlers? I would rather go out with two divas only because then I can meet those five favorite wrestlers. So yeah, I'd probably pick that. And um, if I could sub to you, I don't know. It depends if you are awesome. Jormi Perez asked, my question for next week is what the... Oh no, I'm not going to say that. This is a PG show. Jormi Perez... 
Who do you think you are? Who the hell do you think you are? This is a PG show. We don't fucking curse on this show. My God, using that foul language. God, you are such a fucking asshole. I've never been this mad ever since the YWN has been, like, poop. It's been shit. Ever since that, I was like, what? I was like, what the fuck? Ah, that gets me so mad. I don't know what the fuck happened to the YWN, and I don't know what the fuck happened to you. But you know what? I know that the YWN is going to be making a return. So next, next, for, for the question, put a question, but don't curse. And maybe you'll, you will be revived just like the YWN. So, I think that's my answer. <laughs> Julian Maduros asks, what high school do you go to? I'm sorry, man. Um, I'm not going to give that information out. But um, for the last person that had that question, um, I, I'm not mad. I don't, I don't give a fuck if, if you curse. But I don't, the YWN is going to be making um, a return. So um, be looking forward to that. But for this question, um, I'm sorry, I can't give that information out. CM Punk Fan 434 asks, How do you make your videos like the intro and can you make a tutorial? Um, I actually use. Wow, the camera looks really bad. Um, but <laughs> I usually use iMovie to make my videos. And um, for my intros, I use a lot of different things. I use iMovie, I use. Um, Animoto, I, I don't know what it's called, but it's like Animoto, something like that, but, um, yeah, so next question, oh wait, and if I could do a tutorial, um, I mean, I'll try, but, uh, no guarantees, so, next question, Jack Fan asks, what is your favorite figure from San Diego Comic Con? My favorite figure from San Diego Comic Con would have to be the Rated R Superstar Edge, or the Razor Ramon, or the Hulk Hogan, or the Sting. So yeah, those are all the questions I have for this week. Um, leave questions for next week down in the comments below. And this is actually a new segment that I wanted to add to the show. It's um, a store hat. So here's the store hat for today. Okay, so I just um, had some Jack in the Box. Now I'm here at Walmart. Um, sorry, I'm riding my longboard. Um, but. Yeah, we're gonna see what figures they have. Holy fucking sh shit. Oh my god. They have all of Elite 29. They have El Torito. That's pretty cool. I already have them though. Luke Harper, Goldust. Luke Harper. The Usos. Yeah. I already got them though. I'm, I'm just gonna wait for the Elite. Um, they have all the basics from. 42, I believe. See, here's Natalia. There's El Torito, the Roman Reigns, Tista. Um, I think I might pick up this gold dust. Not sure yet, but um, yeah. So now let's actually check out the real section. Yeah. Sorry that you're not really looking at anything right now, but because I'm carrying my board. Ugh. Okay, here's the real section. And I hear, they not like that, like they have anything. Um, but yeah, hey, I found V29 Gold Dust, so I think I might get this. Maybe Natty. So um, yeah, that is it for this video. Thank you guys for watching, and until then, I will see you in my next video. Or well, actually, you will see me right now reviewing a figure. So yeah. I didn't even know they made this DVD. What? Sting? Best of Sting. Wow, that's cool. And summer sun right there. Wow. Hey guys, so today we are going to be looking at Elite 29, Eric Rowan. Um, here comes with the sheet mask, of course the figure, and a rocking chair. Um, so yeah. This is how it looks like, the back of the packaging, and um, I think I'm trying to get um, all the 
all of the Wyatt's in Elite um, because I got all the shield in basic and I kind of regret it because I want them in Elite now. See, I have Eric Rowan in um, basic form. He had the same exact head scan. So, um, yeah, I have all of the Wyatt family. Um, the only one I'm missing from Elite is Luke Harper. I have, because I have Elite 28, Bray Wyatt, and I, I do have the Luke Harper, but he's basic. So, um, yeah, let's get this figure open and let's get on to review. Okay, so I got him out of the package and, um, here is the Wyatt family, um, Elite, Elite, and Basic. Um, okay, so let me take this off. Um, well, here's a little comparison between the chairs. They're actually a different color. Um, here's the Basic, um, from the, the little thing is, um, in my accessory box, so, um, I think I prefer this one. This one's a little bit more of an orange. This one's, I don't know, it seems a little, like, lighter. And I, I, I prefer this one more than that one, but, um, it's still pretty cool. Um, I'm glad mine didn't come, like, kind of messed up because I heard Bucci tubes and, and XX Terminators came all bad, so that sucks. Um, so here it is. Something that I don't really like, though. It's, like, I don't know. See, there's like a little crack right there. Um, of course, it has all the articulation. Um, here's the basic. Um, so here's a little comparison. Here, this one seems a little bit more, like, thick, like bigger, and then this one seems more skinny. Um, they have the same exact head scan, though. Um, uh, see, same head scan. Um, of course, same jumpsuit, just articulation with this one. Um, let's see. Um, I kind of hate this. Like, the jumpsuit um, kills some of the articulation. See? Kind of sucks. Compared to, like, other elites, where you can put them more up. I don't know kind of kills articulation there but it's still a pretty cool figure um with the mask it looks amazing i really like it um so yeah let me try to put this mask on again all right so there it is um it's an awesome figure so yeah thank you guys for watching and um yeah until then um i'm trying to get luke harper and until then i'll see you in my next video Okay, so, um, this episode was honestly really hard to film. I don't know why, um, it took me two days, and, um, so I wasn't, and I'm also gonna be leaving right now, so, I'm sorry, but I can't make an animation for you guys, but I'm gonna give you a sneak peek on some, uh, of an animation that I'm working on, so, that is, after this animation, that is it for this video, um, I'll probably, I'll try to make one later on today, um, some new stuff, um, which will be pretty cool, and, um, yeah, so, here it is, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.